five years ago. Like all the marketplaces in the market, they were focused on selling very cheap products to hundreds of thousands, if not millions of consumers every day. And by doing so, they were forgetting about a very large share of the consumers that were growing increasingly wealthy and that wanted to buy branded products that has lesser access to offline retail. So we started from this willingness to sell branded products and we came up with the idea of Le Flair. My name is Loïc Gauthier and I'm the Chief Executive Officer and the Co-Founder of Le Flair. Le Flair is an e-commerce website that every single day we would launch new limited time sales uh, filled with you know, products with, from multiple categories such as fashion, beauty and home and living that we would sell at up to 80% of retail. All of those international shopping hubs that have a lot of brands that people want to buy here but have no domestic presence in the market, we will find ways to give consumers of the region access to those products. It's definitely a challenge to start a company that sells someone else's product without an existing operation. And you have to accept to invest in buying up front this inventory until you gain their trust and you prove them that you can sell a very large quantity of their merchandise. A lot of startups that are growing bigger, it was about continuously building a culture and keeping people accountable and responsible for maintaining the culture and the standards of quality and so on. That's something that we keep on solving on a daily basis. For five years from now, I hope and will work very hard for it to be selling our products across Southeast Asia and bringing all the brands from the US, Europe, Japan, Korea and other you know, international shopping hubs to the country. Every single country that has a large share of its population that is growing richer and, and wants to buy more branded product and international brands can benefit from a business like Le Flair.